I love my duality. It's the lashes. Like my lashes really give me that baby doll look or whatever. That baby girl look, okay? But that being said, look at the little heart. That being said, I really do love my duality. I was telling my friend, I'm so secure in myself, my journey. Like nothing can phase me and I feel like she's getting crazier and crazier and I'm able to handle it. And if I would have told myself or talked to myself 10 years ago that we on this type of time, I probably would have broke down crying because 10 years ago or however long ago, I don't know. Somebody told me today I like 21 and I was like, yes. Mm, that's how we age, baby. But yeah, a while ago I was in bed, depressed, never set boundaries, insecure. Like honestly, between my adult work and just, I guess, overthinking and analyzing every little thought I have in life, I've gone to a very beautiful place and I'm so grateful for that. But anyway, yo. Yep, 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 yep. It's the lashes. She's so cute. I'm comfortable with both. I showed up to the shop yesterday looking like a whole dude. Okay. All right. London shawties, like a whole dude. I'm embracing it. I've been embracing it. And today I popped out looking real cute. I don't know who I'm going to pop out tonight. I'll be at her shop. I'm going to go handle some things real quick. Oh, I'm going to handle some things and I'm going to take the bus over i still want to be careful i shouldn't be out at night like la 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 like this but she said the area is 50 50 and when you get to that main road it's all light so oh my my business but today was so good carnival was so lit bro like oh man life is good i'm so grateful i'm blessed life is fun right now life is i'm gonna enjoy every single motherfucking day baby I had somebody at Carnival. I know everybody grabbing and trying to fucking just horny or whatever. And even the dude I talked about, like, yeah, we had a moment, but you think I'm the first girl he approached at Carnival? Don't play with that. I learned that with Budapest Boy. I ain't playing no games. But anyways, there was one guy, like, so many, bro. But there was one guy, he was sweet. I was smiling and laughing. He goes, yeah, 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 please smile again. I was like, I like something like that. One of my SNAP members just told me to check my cash app, and I love that for me. Y'all, drunk off as 4% cider is crazy, but I also had some, I had drinks from the store earlier, which I didn't think they was going to hit, but it actually hit. Because ginger and rhubarb, like, what is that? That shit was good. I was surprised. I see what y'all doing in the UK. Eating hula hoops, reading about Notting Hill. There was a crowd crush that they reported, and I felt it. I was in it. My friend said she felt claustrophobic and like she was suffocating. I don't go to big events, so this was really like the first one in a long time. There were old heads filming. Like literally, we had the camera pointed at us twice, like up close and personal. I know I'm filming other people too, but like literally, like you're here, camera was here, and old heads just smiling at you, like do something. I'm gonna go home and wink to this. I was like, my bad. That was my cousin. She said she gonna close shop and we gonna straight to the pub. Girl, I am the pub. I need to go straight to sleep. I ain't got no storage on my phone. I gotta wake up. We having a content day tomorrow. We're going to the ball pit place. Let me not tell y'all too much, but my friend's going to all the places I wanted to hit anyway. She's really cool. Very beautiful. Great to conversate with. Lovely vibe. Great energy. But um, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, the old head's filming you. Like, no social cues, bro. Carnival, honestly, was so many things. I can't even talk about it. I'm lit right now, yeah. But it's, I can't even tell you, like, all the things it was. Because, like, uh-huh. I also gotta stop saying I'm on the way when I'm not, cause that's just really rude and disrespectful. I'm not trying to be funny. Do I look like I'm on the way anywhere? But she said she need her shoes or something. Anyways, I also wanted to say that being at Carnival, I felt that Caribbean pride. It felt so good. It felt really good. And my mom, when she would like, people would ask her, she'd always say, oh, I'm Dutch with Suriname, like descent or from Suriname. Cause I think my grandma, I don't know, like if she was, Born, I think my grandma was born in Amsterdam, but she's of Surinam descent. I don't know, but I realized that like there is island in our blood. She would always say of Surinam descent, and I was like, damn, that's a mouthful. But like, I understand the pride of like where you come from now. I never really had it with my city, cause I never really connected with my city like that. I guess, but I get it. I am proud to say like, hey, my family is from Amsterdam. Hey, you know this and the third. And I realized when she was repping the island roots, because that's also part of our blood. I was like, oh, still got a little European, got a little island, and I guess it all makes sense at the end of the day. You know, they colonize all our shit. So, but yeah, I I, I respect it. I respect the representation, and it felt good. Like, made me want to immediately go to the Caribbean carnival. Man, it was.
it's lit. It's lit. People were shaking ass and doing whatever, rolling up weed in the street, bruh, smoking in the street. That crowd crush was a little nerve wracking, but people was drunk, lit, etc. It did get a little raunchy and a little rowdy. People was dead ass almost fucking in the streets, but we lit. I'm about to go get ready. I look, look at me looking French with a little beret. Ooh, ooh. Okay, so I need, <laughs> she switched up so quick. I'm about to get ready to go link with my cousin. <laughs> I'll see y'all. Let's go. <laughs> I feel so badass these days. This is really cute. My friend actually has this tattoo, but I might start doing this. Heart and three dots might be my thing. Not me with the fake face tats. Now I'm about to go to work and drink cider, but everybody already there, drunk and high anyways. That's the one nice thing about working with family. Everybody lit, it don't matter. My cousin's like, you want some wine, you want this? <laughs>